Hello my friends and channel subscribers, Greg here from Brisbane, Australia with another uncut, unedited, no bull video. Today, video about life hack, something that I didn't know and helped me so much that I refuse not to share it. This is not my invention, straight away. I, help, I was helped by someone who I respect a lot, although I did not believe in solution. So what happened before? You know, Australia, we've got end of summer and we've got a lot of summer fruit and we always store them in a bowl and from nowhere you got fruit flies. And I've got no idea what's so irritating about fruit flies. They don't bite, they don't make any noise, they're just flying around, but yet they manage to irritate us so much. And when they appear in your property or place that you're sitting in, it looks like there's no way to get rid of them until today. So I refuse to use any chemicals or pesticides to kill anything around me because I'm living a healthy lifestyle. And if I start using chemicals to kill pests and, and flies and so on, um, I just don't believe those chemicals are not harmful. If they're killing little creature, surely they will have some effect on us. So I refuse to use all the fly sprays, all the pesticides and all of that. So how did I get um, fruit flies? It's actually an interesting story because I did not get them because of the fruit. Uh, I posted a video a couple of weeks ago, um, me making ice cream and um, uh, homemade chocolate. And um, I made this for years and years, it's just now I created TV and for some reason flies are getting attracted to cocoa and despite me cooking and placing what I cook either in a fridge or freezer, the cloth I clean up, the surfaces, they probably still smell for the fruit flies and um, especially in the summer uh, when you get them, it's, there's no way to get rid of them. So I shared a concern with a couple of people and one person that they respect came back and said, well, there's a natural solution to kill them. I said, yeah, well, enlighten me um, what to do. And the person say, well, you take um, half glass of apple cider vinegar and you take the dishwashing liquid and put a couple of drops in Mix it all together and leave outside where fruit flies fly. And they all get in and they die and they're gone. I say, yeah, of course. But guess what? I use apple cider vinegar on a daily basis for my own health routine and also I wash in dishes. So I had both ingredients and I thought, well, I've got nothing to lose. What? There's nothing to lose. Let's try it. So I pour apple cider vinegar, I used um, half glass of 250 ml, so probably I placed maybe 150, maybe, maybe 200 ml of uh, apple cider vinegar in a bowl, in a bowl like that. And then I dropped a couple of uh, drops of dishwashing liquid, maybe more than a couple. And I noticed that flies start getting attracted to this area and say, yeah, how to kill them all. But guess what? Four, four days later, they're all gone. And I would like to show you, if I can, what's inside the bowl. I'm not sure if it's visible. It's 30 or 40 of those flies, all dead in the bottom of that bowl. And I don't have any fruit flies in the property. Took four to five days, kill entire infestation of the fruit flies. It's unbelievable, it's amazing and too good not to share. So if you've got fruit flies in your area or you're just about to get them, apple cider vinegar, I believe the cheapest uh, would do. A couple of uh, dishwashing uh, liquid um, soap or whatever it is uh, drops in, mix it all together, leave it for four or five days, problem solved. Well, if you like this video or any other video on this channel, please subscribe, like and comment down below what other things would you like to know, whether it's life hacks, nutrition, sport, exercise, lifestyle, 
mindset. Whatever you can say about it, I've got things to say, I've got the experience to share, and I would be doing it gladly with you. Thank you so much for watching. Greg from Brisbane, Australia.